Hello, I'm Isaac Mbazia, the caretaker of this greenhouse. Uh, this greenhouse was installed here by Balton, Uganda, under the funds from Kibo Foundation. Uh, this greenhouse here benefits both the school and the community at large. The community benefits through getting the knowledge of commercial and modern agriculture. The students are also benefiting from the same, doing the practical part of the science and agriculture. The students from the 30th and 31st class chose this project to try and help Sasi Primary School um, improve on the diet. Um, having a greenhouse would help supply them with food and also as well it was an income generating activity and that's why they chose this project. Today we happen to be at the greenhouse project. This project was done at Kisasi Primary School by the 30th and 31st class. It's a long journey. It's a dream come true. Uh, the students had a negative attitude about it. Most of them thought it was very expensive. But as you know, if you need to learn something, sometimes you need to learn things through the hard way. The concept of the greenhouse was developed among us the 30th and 31st classes. Initially, the project seemed alien, the greenhouse project seemed alien because most of the guys, most of the students were used to the other traditional ways, the other traditional projects of uh, getting a community and buying for them produce, buying for them items. But this time, the greenhouse was something different. Today I'm very happy that what was like a dream, what was like a story, or a script put on the paper, is practical. As you can see, I'm holding tomatoes here. In particular, we the youth have got what to do. We the youth have become partners in fighting the economy of Uganda. Because as I hold the tomatoes here, it's not only tomatoes. I know how to make them, my group know how to make them, and we have the skills. I've never seen this in my life. And I didn't know that it can make a lot of money. I've loved everything. I've loved the tomatoes. And in the interview I had, with one of the people taking care of it, he said that it's making a lot of money. I didn't know that. I love this. And I'm planning to tell my mom about it so that maybe we also do the same at home and in our village. Thank you very much. To me, it shows that when the youth decide to do something, when the youth focus on something, they can achieve a lot. With focus, determination and commitment, a lot can be achieved. And we can see that as the greenhouse is now standing and you can see this beautiful tomato here, very healthy, and the others as well. We are very proud of the achievement we've, we've made and we are thankful to the support that Kibo Foundation gave us, that KCCA gave us, and all the well wishers gave us. I've got the spirit of doing work, beyond my, of providing service beyond self. Secondly, I've been inspired but I can invest more in agriculture because it's profitable. Right now we are yielding and as time goes on, I believe we are going to yield more and more and more. And I believe it's going to be a great impact to the society and to the community, to the school fraternity and to the whole society to be inspired by the whole project. My personal experience on this has been I've really, I've really begun to appreciate farming and I, it's something that I'm definitely going to look into going into in the future. And it's been really rewarding because this has been a huge, huge project and at times it was frustrating, it was tough, but when you look at what we've achieved, I think it's a really great accomplishment. This project is a project that we were welcomed and that the school and the community is benefiting. We have learned a lot and we wish that uh, it is more expanded if we can have another greenhouse around because the land we have enough so that even the community around who come and admire can do the same. If you look at the products of this greenhouse, they are really very, very, very beautiful near the community. Sasi Primary School is the, uh, are the beneficiaries and we hope they are going to live on with this project. They are going to take it ahead. It's going to be sustainable the way we have managed to sustain it since day one, since it, it's, it, it's start. I'm just encouraging each and every one, especially the youth out there, please change your mindset and you'll change communities. To me, this is a success. I take this opportunity to thank, thank everybody who is around and thank our partners 
for the greenhouse. Uh, as Kisasi Primary School, we are really pleased to have this greenhouse in our school. Uh, it has benefited all the stakeholders, the teachers, parents, uh, pupils, and the community as well. Uh, the greenhouse has benefited the school in that pupils come and learn. We do get the tomatoes and prepare pupils' meals. We even sell. To, we thank Kibo Foundation, I thank KCCA and UN Appetant.